They have an air of permanence, another sign of how positional this war has become. In Zaporizhia in southern Ukraine, Defence Minister Rustam Umarov is shown newly built defences, long stretches of freshly dug trenches, clear evidence that Ukraine is moving to a defensive footing. Amidst the trenches are steel bunkers, able to sleep six soldiers and withstand a Russian artillery strike. In front of the bunkers and trenches, rows of dragon's teeth barricades, anti-tank ditches and minefields. In the northern sector alone, military officials say they've increased defences by more than 60% in the past few months. Other bunkers are made from reinforced concrete and welded together in situ. These, it's hoped, will help Ukraine withstand Russian assaults and reduce the number of casualties, giving Kyiv some breathing room to replenish its manpower and ammunition. Fortifications like this are being installed along the Eastern Front, but also along Ukraine's border with Belarus, as far west as Poland. President Zelensky has also ordered the southern sector around Kherson to be reinforced. With neither side able to make a decisive breakthrough, Ukraine is digging in for a long war. Simon Newton, Forces News. Thanks for watching. For more from Forces News, like and subscribe to our channel.